Hello, today is June 1st, 2023. My name is Martin Hidayat and I will be filming a video source inspection on an 840S. The customer is located here in the United States for, their, for privacy purposes. I'll just be referencing their PO number, which is 081681. While I take you along on this video source inspection, we'll kind of go over the tool and start the tool. As you can see, we have some custom cassettes here with uh, 60 slots each one. Got some substrates. It's identical for the top and the bottom chambers. We'll go ahead and get this started. Just to tell you a little bit more about our process, we typically start out with a, a, a rinse cycle which is typically uh, anywhere from uh, one to 60 seconds. And then we go into a straight purge, which will blow that into, uh, into the chamber. As you can tell, um, this is a little smaller than others. We've customized our framing to fit within a couple of wet benches. Um, this is uh, less than 12 and a half inches in width as in the frame, as you can tell. Take a look on the on the other side. We have other SRDs that, which are the standard width of a little over 13 and a quarter. We're currently dwindling down from our rinse cycle, and we're going to go into our purge, which is a 10 second purge. This customer has sent in their substrates and cassettes to make sure that we customize each of the rotors to fit their needs. Both chambers have jumped into a dry one cycle as the top is at 90 seconds and the bottom is at 90 seconds. We're cruising along real quick. Customer has uh, chosen to use the new SciTech Slick device, which is our graphical interface controller. Uh, one of the one of the best controllers out in the market that will simply replace the PSC 101 and uh, PSC 102 controllers with a slight modification. In these features that we have with these controllers, these controllers will have um, a, a maintenance mode that will allow you to actuate each valve, like your uh, low pressure purge, your N2 heater, and the bowl heater just to do a simple diagnostic to see how their um, the consumption is and if they're actually working. We have alarms that will, uh, will, will stop and will pinpoint what the issue may be. If your N2 is off, it'll show you that there's no N2 pressure. Other than that, um, we have one of our main components that we we think is very beneficial for uh, many of our customers is our N2 saver. As you know, over the years, N2 saver uh, and N2 costs have went up in price. Uh, typically, what we look at is uh, when, when, when a lot of the SRDs back in the days were sitting in idle, the N2 was purging out, which was a waste of N2. Now with our slick device, when you go into idle and you're not using your SRD, the N2 will shut off, which will save you several uh, amounts of dollars to thousands, depending on the, the, the usage that you have per chamber. All right, so we're currently in the dry two cycle. Um, we're kind of ramping down to the 500 RPM, lower RPM, longer time. So we got about 150 seconds on top and the bottom. Other items that we have at SciTech is, uh, or, or we offer our uh, HTC box washer refurbishments, 100% parts and service for box washers, mask cleaners, and of course our, our SRDs. Um, we have two dedicated employees to each one of our customers someone that is typically outside in the field and one inside. And we also allow 
if you, you're in the fab and you have an issue, feel free to give us a call. We'll help you uh, troubleshoot that issue while you're in the fab and make sure that your process has not came to a complete stop. All right, we got about 100 seconds left. Um, currently, the N2 valve, if you actually take a look, N2 valve is working correctly. N2 heater, the anti-static, the bowl heater, and the LPP valve. Everything seems to be functioning wonderful as of right now. With our SRDs, not only do we do sell new SRDs, we refurbish SRDs once they do come into... Uh, once they're sent in, crated, we will crate them, we'll uncrate it, uh, put it together, evaluate it, and really diagnose each component and see uh, the functionality of each one. And then we'll break each component down, clean it, test it, uh, and replace it with new or tested items. Crate it and uh, send it right back to you. It's really a key feature that we have. Um, as you know, after using these for several years, uh, we can turn it into a like new condition, which is, uh, which is fantastic. All right, 30 seconds to go. Looks like everything is going up to what we're looking for. If, if you wanted to uh, fit one of these into a very tight space, feel free to reach out to us. We at SciTech will do anything custom, custom rotors, custom inserts, um, along, along with custom framing, as you can see. We've hit the last three seconds of this cycle, and we're coming to an end. As you can see, this will shift into a 12 o'clock cycle. The piston ended up. Same thing on the bottom. Our process is done. We will open... The chamber, pull out the substrates, take a look at them, looks dry, feels warm, no water spots, and that will complete our, our process. Please feel free to reach out to us at sales at scitechprocess.com. My name is Martin Hedayat, and I hope you have a wonderful day.